What is the cause of teeth whining? Hi, my name is Dr. Stephanie. I'm a dentist of Dental House. Yesterday, one of our patients, Peter from Becker's Marsh, asked me about the cause of teeth whining. So I thought I'll make a video sharing with you what I share with him. First of all, teeth whitening is a very popular cosmetic treatment. These days, people always want straighter and whiter teeth. Generally speaking, there are two ways of doing teeth whitening. The first way is through a professional dentist, which is the way we recommend. And I'll explain why shortly. The other way is to purchase products off the internet or through a local chemist. And a lot of times that's a lot cheaper and there are reasons why that's the case. As a dentist, I urge everyone to have a dental consultation and assessment of their teeth before doing any forms of teeth whitening, whether it's professional or over the counter. The reason is that over the years, people have come to me because they bought a product off the internet or off the shelf and they have had major issues with how the product was impacting their teeth, whether it's too strong for their teeth or it was burning their gum. So regardless of what you choose, it is super important to double check with a dentist in terms of the product that you're using, how you're using it, and also check your teeth to make sure that you are safe to do teeth whitening. Now, if you do teeth whitening through a dentist, there are usually two ways of doing it. You can have an in-office laser whitening that could range anywhere between $500 to $900, or you can do take-home teeth whitening, which a dentist will take a specialized mold and make some trays with whitening gel that is customized for you and usually that costs a little bit less, between $400 to $600. So what determines how much it costs? Factor number one is how yellow are your teeth and what sort of result you want to get to. If you have really yellow teeth or even worse, like if your teeth are grey, then it is very hard to whiten. Then you may need a longer time to get your teeth to a colour that you want. Some people have antibiotic staining in the teeth, which could be like brown, dark brown, yellow streaks, and these are really, really hard to whiten. With teeth whitening treatment, you can get fantastic results within two to three weeks. But if you have a color that is really hard to do whitening through, then you may have to do persistent whitening for up to four to six months in order to get the result that you want. So duration is an important factor to consider when it comes to the price of teeth whitening. Secondly, it's the type of whitening products that your dentist use. There are so many brands out there most of them are quite similar, but doing teeth whitening through a company such as Zoom, which is a very well-known and established brand, can be slightly more expensive than other brands, which you may or may not have heard of. So the quality of the product and the brand can affect the price. So that's pretty much about it. Teeth whitening is probably one of the most effective ways to improve the appearance of our teeth without doing any major work. Here at Dental House, we have done thousands of teeth whitening as part of our cosmetic dental treatment over the years, so we can definitely help you. Simply give us a call on 1800 Gentle, direct messages on social media, or complete the inquiry form on our website. See you in the next video.